Hey guys, how's it going? I'm really sorry for the lack of videos lately. It's finals time, everything's a little bit crazy. Winter means EDS flare-ups, it's not great. But I'm here now and this week we are going to talk about my original characters. Basically, if you haven't been following me on social media, I am in love with an app called TikTok, which it's kind of like Vine. You make short videos, but there are a lot of cosplayers on it and a lot of opportunities to make original characters. And that is what I have been doing. So in this video, I thought I would compile a bunch of videos that show all of my original characters on the app and give a little description about them. Unfortunately, the videos themselves are muted because I'm not sure if the songs that I use in the videos would be copyright claimed on YouTube. So if you wanna see what the videos would sound like themselves, then go to TikTok and follow me. My at will be in the box below, but it is that chronic illness with one S. And without further ado, let's get into it. The first character I ever made on TikTok was Cinders. She is from the Marked LARP universe, which is a LARP I wanted to go to but couldn't. It's basically an X-Men sort of superhero school. So Cinders can read minds, and she found this out on her first day of high school. Afterwards, she adopted a goth tough persona so people would leave her alone and she wouldn't have to hear all the thoughts. I got my inspiration for her character from my autism and how I feel when I'm overstimulated. And I tried to translate that into, well, this clip, basically, how she would feel when too many voices and thoughts were coming at her at once. I haven't made any videos of her in a while, but I would like to because it's fun putting on the goth makeup. And since she's my first character that I ever made videos of, I have a soft spot for her. She's just really entertaining. The next character I made is for the Hogwarts Professor's Tag, and that is Professor Dahlia Vossen. She is a half-elf and very self-conscious about it. She is from Iceland and teaches Old Norse runes and runic magic, which I basically chose because I was taking an Old Norse class during the semester. Professor Vossen is everything I want to be, basically. Very confident, very skilled, self-assured, pretty fantastic, honestly. I had a great time making these videos, and before I started in the Wix Academy tag, she was probably my main OC. I made the most videos of hers, and if you go on my page, you will see a ton more with a lot of people. The Hogwarts Professor's tag is very diverse, very plot heavy, and just really, really fun, honestly. It was a great tag to jump into, it reignited my love for Harry Potter, and I really enjoyed seeing what all of the bigger creators would do in order to further the story. This clip here shows her kind of being, not possessed, but um, being taken over by a darker nature of herself, and I made that during Halloween. Uh, she had, as I mentioned, been very ashamed that she was part elf, but after the Halloween debacle, she kind of decided to stop hiding it and just be herself, whatever that meant. This clip came from a ball that we had, which was pretty amazing, a masquerade. Uh, so I got to fight in a ball gown, wear a mask, and just generally have an amazing time. I do plan on making more videos of her soon. The other most popular OC tag on TikTok, I would say, is the Mafia tag. So of course, I jumped right in. This is Sophia Tenmini. She is also known as the Honeypot, and she basically gets what she wants by using her looks. I had a lot of fun being Sophia, partially because she's so much meaner and more manipulative than I ever could be, but also because I'm not wearing my glasses, so anytime I filmed a video of her, I couldn't see anything at all. If you look closely, you can actually see that my eyes aren't focusing because I couldn't see the camera. Even though I wasn't really involved in the main plots of the Mafia tag, I had a lot of fun pretending to be a Mafia member, acting pretty badass, and just generally posing and feeling attractive. Would highly recommend it. I also joined a small tag called The Unexplained, which was about demon hunting and possessions and things like that. This is Maya Zippa. She is a witch with Austrian heritage, and she is not afraid to go head-to-head -head with any ghost, demon, or other baddie that might come her way. Here we have Mariella Hollymion, a little D&D &D character I made for myself. She is an elven sorceress who works in a circus, and if angered, will be more than a little dangerous. 
I only made these two videos of her, but if I have some free time, I would definitely like to film more because she was very intriguing, I suppose. Finally, we have my newest and favorite character, Delilah Jardim. She is a part of the Wix Academy tag, which is a magic school. Delilah is an empath who is very good at controlling and manipulating other people's emotions, but is terrible at controlling her own. I have a ton of fun with this character because the tag and everyone in it is so creative, the story is very intriguing, and honestly, playing an emotional wreck is very cathartic, not to mention funny. Delilah is very good at trying to cheer people up. She's very, very sweet and just wants to learn more magic. The school is probably evil and I'm sure there will be a battle at some point, but for now Delilah is just trying to make friends, helping people and learn as much magic as she possibly can, which is always fun. Again, definitely check out the other creators on this tag. They are all so fantastic. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little look at my original characters and I will see you next week. Bye.